So Nancy's Pelosi house in San Francisco got vandalized. Um, thankfully, no one got hurt. But apparently, on the on the garage wall and in front of the garage, on the garage wall, it said "Force the vote, uh, cancel a two thousand check, uh, force the vote, two thousand dollar checks, um, cancel debt," I believe. And on the driveway was a pig's head. So, um, people are sick and tired. Her own constituents are sick and tired of her shenanigans. She's been in power longer than the Belarusian leader, Lukashenko. <laughs> her and Mitch McConnell, man, they gotta go. They've just been in power. They've been, they've been in power for too long, man. They just gotta go. They gotta go. And, uh, they're out of touch. They really are out of touch. And, um... I mean, you can be in power for a long time, but if you're out of touch, man, you're useless. You're, you're dangerous. And uh, it shows. So, Americans need that $2,000 check, $2, check back last January. They needed a UBI. They needed a UBI four or five years ago, eight years ago, 12 years ago, 30 years ago, 60 years ago. You know, we needed $15 an hour back in the 1980s. You know, we needed that back then. We needed... Now we need above $20 an hour minimum wage. You know? We need to ta start taxing the very wealthy. The extremely wealthy. You know? And I'm talking about the millionaire pluses. The 10 million pluses. The 50 millionaire pluses. The 100 millionaire pluses. I'm not, I'm not talking about them. I'm talking about... Yeah, we got to tax them too. But I'm talking about the billion dollar plus, the hundred million dollar plus people. They're the ones that got to be taxed. So we can have our cheap iPhones. We can have our dollar menu, <laughs> dollar menu burgers. You know, all that's got to happen is they got the people at the top. It's got to take a pay cut. You've had too much money for too long. You can still have a lot of money forever. But the rest of us, <laughs> God dang, man, we need help. We need help. And it's... My generation's waiting longer to have kids. My generation can't afford the, the standard of living that we grew up in. Why would you want to raise a child, you know, if you can't afford your own rent? I can't even pay my own rent. I, don't even, I can't even afford rent. That's why I'm living at home. So, I'm glad... Back to Nancy Pelosi... Uh, his house getting vandalized. I'm glad no one got hurt, but I'm not surprised it got vandalized. I really am not. Um, it's I'm, what I am surprised about. It took this long because you would think that with her record and her, and you think all these congressmen's houses would be vandalized because just. But people are, are starting to pay attention now. They're like, wait a minute, you've been in power. You you said this so many years ago. People have a record, so they're they're tired of your shenanigans. They're not playing anymore. But, uh, I gotta go, guys.